From the city of Fierce, yeah, I need advice. You know, say the H2O boss from out of the Steel City. Hashtag Bossy Vision. Tune in and subscribe to Sound System TV for 2019 and beyond. Don't forget the Sound System clothing, neither. The most reviews, the most interviews from me, Humbre Selector Hype. So do remember, hit and press the subscribe button for Sound System TV. A mad thing, an normal thing. In dark by yours truly, the H2O boss, Mr. Boss Division himself. You understand? Selector Hype, big up yourself. I'm out. TV Sound System, Selector Hype Live and Direct, you know what to do. Press like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. We are back big and serious for 2022. And we are live and direct inside the Heritage Centre. I've got to say a big shout out, reach out to all the management, all the staff for giving me the opportunity to use this space here to represent TV Sound System. So make sure you subscribe because we have got some big interviews coming your way. And we're kicking it off in fine style 2022. Now, if you look at my previous um, top 10 for 2022, when we're talking about the <coughs> UK sound systems, I had to make it my issue, I had to make it my business, not to only name the 10 sound systems, but to also make sure I can get a conversation with them, not only to give you the reason why I put them under my top 10, but the reason why they can also represent themselves and put themselves on the top 10. We're going to the place we call Coventry. Now, Coventry is a place where sound system resides and has been for a long time. But we're seeing something new on the scene. We're seeing a brand new sound coming out and they are controlling the place. Not only Coventry, but their name is being called all around the UK. Hence the reason why, one, I had to put them in their top 10, in my top 10, and two, the reason why I had to get them down here in the city of Wolverhampton to have a sit down conversation. Remember, it's a conversation. It's not an interview. It's a conversation. We're talking facts. <laughs> That's one of the main things that we're going to be doing right now. So inside the building, we're going to welcome no other than the X5 family out of Coventry. How are you doing? Big up yourself, Mark, yeah. And um, yeah, all the way there. I'm DJ Super Shack. Little Briggy. Yep, yep. Big up on yourself, UK, you don't know. Yeah, ZJ Demos, straight from the XY family, right? Mark, big up yourself. Enough respect each and every time. First of all, I want to say thank you so much because before we start the interview, man travelled all the way from Manchester. Bam. Come on the train, bam, bam, bam. come all the way to Wolverhampton just to come and sit down and have the interview sound systems take notice man they putting in the effort putting in the work taking the time out to make sure they represent so big respect going out to you each and every time yeah man definitely fully dedicated you know what i'm saying we're gonna pass over to the main man we're gonna, we're gonna call a little the main man <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anything gonna say <laughs> okay so what we're gonna do we've got a bit of time yeah so i'm thinking whether we want to just have an x5 family conversation rather than try and interview each individual yeah, yeah, member yeah, 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 but we're going to go back and forth <laughs> this is a conversation. One, you know. yeah. so <laughs> <laughs> so let's go to you little brig i want to go to the beginning of your career yeah um have you always resided in coventry where where where, where was you based and yes yeah, so how did you grow up um tell us about your early days in music come yeah, on so i i grew up um with my father my father's sound is black crusader my, my dad's sound is Black Crusader, mm -hmm. so it's in the blood. I started playing Black Crusader from I was about 18 years old. Okay. Um, and from there, really, you know, I was... The Clash scene was my... That was my thing. Mm -hmm. And at that time there, when you, when you say your dad was uh, Black Crusader... Yeah. <laughs> That's something that we can't take lightly because I know that a lot of people then would know Black Crusade as one of the best sound systems to come out of um, Coventry. Yeah. Watching your dad play that sound system, um, what kind of vibes? What, what kind of vibes was you seeing your father put across, and how was he representing Black Crusader? So, Black Crusader was all, well, well known for a, a clash sound as well. Mm -hmm. um, me growing up and watching it from I was a little kid, I also used to I was going to cock and dances from I was like 11, 12 in Bristol when I used to live in Bristol years ago. Um, and Malcolm X and I used to go in there when I was 10, 11 and watch them with Kilimanjaro and stuff. Mm -hmm. So the clash scene for me was just in me. Yeah. 
You know what I mean? So Black Crusader, obviously, I, I started playing with them um, and decided I wanted to build my own team. And why, why, why build your own thing considering Black Crusader is a name, it's your father's sound, that's mm. something that you could have just took up and ran with that and gone clear. You know what I mean? Why, what, what made you say, I you think, know what, I kind of want to... I think it was, it's, it's more of... <clears throat> Yeah, the, the, it's, it's the passion for it and not only that there's a way of building a sound system mm -hmm. now for me I'm no no disrespect but black crusader was a thing where like when i'm voicing dub plates i know what i want i know how i want it i know mm -hmm. what rhythm i want it on and i know how i'm going to execute it okay yeah, I'm not just going to send my money to Jamaica or to a studio and just get what you're given. Mm -hmm. That's not how I believe sound system should run. Was Black Crusader doing that? Like, no, like you said, no disrespect. I mean, like, was that, was that something that you were seeing that was the reason why you, th you thought, you know what, as much as it is my dad's sound, I kind of want to just do I my thing. Go on then. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm a um, DJ Super Chat for... Black Crusader original, way, way back in the day. So back in the day, you, you're talking early 90s. Um, um, I started up a, a, a soundboard, lifting up boxes and everything, and then got into the aspect of, you know what, I so, said, you know what, I need to get into this clashing thing. Mm -hmm. So I selected, so I learned the trade by listening to old cassettes and everything. Um, got into the trade of selecting and everything. And then basically the, the, the money that used to be sent back in, in yard back in the day, which is like a lump sum of money and you just go deal with it. The studio will just deal with it. Mm -hmm. So you're not getting what you really going asking for. Mm -hmm. And then you've got to chase up again and say, look, that's not what I wanted. Mm -hmm. So now where Little Big is coming from now, where we've our experience and, and where we're coming from, we want to be in control of what we're getting okay and it's like going to a shop and, and buying something you, you don't like you got to take send it back now we want to be in control of the rhythm tracks the artists um the, the studio guy you know uh, building a, a relationship with him mm -hmm. and say you know what this is what we want now we have a good relationship with the um, the guy in jamaica now mm. and basically it, everything that he says and then he'll get ideas off us or deem us and yeah we want this rhythm track because we constantly we've mm. got our own little Probably group whatsapp group yeah, yeah. we've got our own whatsapp group and um, we're constantly saying, like, we need, need this rhythm track. Oh, we need this artist. The demons mm. say, no, we'll get on this artist and on that okay. rhythm track. So it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a group it's thing. Yeah. Yeah. More organisation right now. And then to be in this now and to actually go into this clashing thing, you have to take it serious. Mm -hmm. it's, it's no joke thing. Now, before, before we get into the... Oh, sorry. Yes, yes, Briggy. Sorry, Matt. So my point was, um, my dad is is and was the owner for Black Crusader Sound. He wasn't a selector, he wasn't a mic man. He was just the owner. Okay. Now, you have to, as a selector, and you're actually pushing out your thing, mm -hmm. you have to be involved and involving the people that are gonna execute it. Mm -hmm. he, was, he didn't never used to go to the selector and say, all right, what do you want from that artist? What rhythm track do you want yeah. it on? He'd just go, he'd go to Jamaica on his own, and come back with the dub plates on the on the records ready, mm -hmm. so you're just getting what you're given as yeah. a selector and rather than being work with what in got, control. Basically. Yeah, uh -huh. which is not what I see that makes a sound system that bit better. Uh -huh. Okay, so clearly, way before <laughs> I even got into the situation, if we had to ask that question on X Five Family, I'm guessing. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, it looks like 95% of, of X5 is based around being a clash sound. Is that right? Yeah, definitely. Heritage, yeah. I, would, I, would, I would say, so we have, we've got a different, different elements to the sections of X5. So we're mm. a juggling sound, we're wow. a clash sound, and we're also a big people sound mm. where our events and stuff that we aim it and target at that Pacific you know that Demographic, whole bigger yeah. picture yeah mm -hmm. yeah so but yeah the, the 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 clash side of it is what it's been built for yeah so there's a lot of preparation and everything that's definitely going on behind the scenes uh you built it like it says as a clash sound mm. um we'll just pass the mic over yeah yeah mm -hmm. introduce yourself again yes mark zjd must represent into all one what for x5 family or one six one side right uh-huh yeah okay so your role on the sound is well, Mike Man. Mike Man. Yeah. 
let's talk about how important it is as a mic man right now, especially in modern day times. Yeah. Yo, we've already just spoken to your fellow two members them. Definitely. Clearly, um, X5 family, world sound. Let's yeah. not forget about that. Hence the reason why <laughs> you said clashing, mm-hmm. juggling, mm-hmm. big people thing. How do you manage to work your way around being a class selector, also being able to juggle and also be, be, being able to be a big people team? Where does your experience come from? Well, experience is from, well, time, mm-hmm. which is Most whatever I've gathered from, I've started. Mm-hmm. And also studying, yeah. which is studying whatever we're going to execute. Mm-hmm. So if it's a clash, we'll study. If we're going to a party to play, We'll do our research. Mm-hmm. We'll put our time in, get the music together, and execute it. Mm-hmm. And in terms of MC, let's t- t- take a look a bit on <coughs> on your background. Yeah, MC is 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 are you a strictly like MC? You don't well, select or I mix. I do mix as well, and I, and I, and, I, and, I, and, I, and I, I'm a DJ as well. Yeah, I'm an all rounder. So we got the talent is there okay. in every every, every aspect. You know Were you specialising in MC? Yes, at the moment. As in, let's go back to modern day times yeah what makes a great modern day selector because obviously like i said x5 family's name is being called mm-hmm. now for your name to be called it's obviously people are listening and to be listening gotta be listening to the mc so Definitely. clearly you're bringing across a vibe that people are listening to um what makes you stand out and what's made you stand out to make people start to cock up them ears and say yo x5 family bye. right well it's all about delivery Mm-hmm. So it's what you deliver to the crowd, and it's what we deliver to the crowd. So we play for the crowd. Mm-hmm. Once the crowd is reacting, we'll give them what they want. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You, are you a sound that <clears throat> will 100% play for the people, mm-hmm. or is there a level where you say, you know what, I'm going to kind of technically play for myself, but I'm going to get you all on my level? Mm. Super shock. Answer that question, you know. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, my big question, because mm-hmm. <clears throat> just the other day we were having a conversation, yeah, <clears throat> about um, uh, looking back at um, clashes and everything, and you, and and the the most important part of you can have a sound that's got the only but dub is how you portray it across to the crowd and how the mic MC portrays it to the people. Then, because if you're not entertaining them people. Right, you're not going to get another booking, mm-hmm. and no one else going to. Th- but talking about you can have the holy, but it's about div- um, putting putting your music together, uh, reading the next sound, and then portraying across to the crowd and mm-hmm. getting the crowd involved yeah. with ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So basically, it's, it's it's a whole package thing. I know, <clears throat> and also, if you strongly believe <clears throat> in what you believe is right, and you know from your own experiences. Mm-hmm. You're gonna, you're gonna play what you believe, and you get the crowd involved. That's what yeah. I believe, anyway. Mm-hmm. Yeah, fully understand. From, that's through your own experiences, yeah. from clash, whatever it might be, <coughs> is what you see that works, and what you know. When mm-hmm. you bring that across, the crowd have got no choice but to get involved. Okay. Yeah. Well, you know what it is. It's TV sound system, selector high, live and direct. X Five family up inside the building. Like I said, this is not an interview. This is a conversation, and this conversation can go super mm-hmm. deep, man. Because yeah, I know that go I've got some super <laughs> questions to ask. Go ready, and ready. I know the man, the, the man is super ready. So we're gonna go back and forth. We normally call this show Pass present and future where we okay. normally start on the past, past then we talk about the present mm. and then we talk about the future but the way how you guys are going back and forth we're just loving that kind of energy so yeah. we're going to just talk about how did the three of you come together and form x5 family where did that whole connection come where we, we're sitting and watching you three guys right mm-hmm. now. Me chat, man. Me yeah. chat, don't worry. You go um, me, I gotta come in and, 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 and then <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. reach back at, yeah. I'm reach back at Demas. Yeah. Right, Love okay, that. right. That. Little Biggie, yeah. True, I was there with um, Crusader, and Father B- Biggie brought me into the thing. And as a little youth, as an eight-year-old, when we played the carnival, um, we used to play the Coventry Carnival. He he came up there, and them mm-hmm. time they was in Bristol. And as I was selecting, I seen I seen Father Biggie say, oh, "I'm a little youth." Them, so Frank, the other side of the brother, he's more quiet. Now this one here, <laughs> you could I could see. Do you know when you see somebody, <laughs> the, the passion. Yeah, seen him. And um, for an 11 year old or 8 year old to come and hold the mic and start chatting yeah. with beer people in front of you and not even squint. <laughs> I was like, yo. And, and basically, I brought him up 
and now if you look back into the, in, into the future we link back again mm-hmm. and so it's like coming back to like father biggie was my um what do you call it and then now i'm here and then we linked up so <coughs> yeah and then just the other day just the other day and, and this is just a little joke thing just the other day we were all in the car with my wife <coughs> and we were talking about yard and um my wife called out a name and he goes hold on that's my family so we just realized that we're all linked wow There's, yeah this is just the other day yeah just uh-huh. the other day so we're all linked mm-hmm. so the, the the link from biggie to demas i'm going to pass you over to biggie so make him just mm-hmm. yeah so <coughs> during lockdown um Z, I just, if you didn't know zj demas is my blood cousin so it's one big family you okay. see so um yeah we linked up obviously i hadn't seen him for a good few years so he was on the music thing and you know i was showing him what i was up to and what i was doing uh, planning in lockdown, voicing dubs, do da, 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 and ZJ. It was just like that was the missing part of the puzzle. Mm. So he's came on board, linked up with Shaq, met them, you know. So that's that's where it come from. Obviously, me and Shaq come from far. Obviously, ZJ Demas is <coughs> part of the family, same way. So me make you Sophia thing now. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I want family. You know that, Mark. So. Obviously, I'm from Jamaica, yeah? Mm-hmm. Which part of Jamaica? St. Catherine. Okay. Linsid, um, Bagwak, Spanish how, Town. How, how long was you in Jamaica before you came over to England? Well, came here when I was 15. Okay. So, let's, let's, let's just backtrack a little bit. Yeah. The little time that you was in Jamaica up until that, mm-hmm, to, to, mm-hmm. to 15, yeah. was music your thing? Yes. Because, um, well, it's in the blood. It's in the blood. It's and in the blood. then, um, Black Crusader. Uh-huh. I've always been hearing about Black Crusader. Mm-hmm. So if it wasn't for Black Crusader, I wouldn't have been in music. But well, let's, I'm going to try and backtrack again to yeah. being yeah. 12. Okay, you, so you left Jamaica. So them 15. times I was about 8, 9. Them ones are flying in. Yeah. They were flying into yard, cutting dub plates. Uh-huh. But anywhere they're going, I'll be behind them. Okay, like like literally like in Jamaica? In Jamaica, yeah. Okay, okay. So I'll always be the youngest one and I'll be behind them. Just watching, acknowledging. And that was taking place over there in Jamaica. Yeah. Away from that, was there anybody else in Jamaica at that time that was like, yo, killing it right now? Like, who you was looking up to? Right. Idol wise, you know what? You see, I'm from St. Catching, as I said. You got so, you got like, say, for example, um, Lord Gellies, Andrew Fresh. Yeah. I've grown up like watching them months, which they, his dad had a sound system called Hollywood, mm-hmm. which is foundation in wow. Jamaica. So I, I was watching them months from back in the days. Mm-hmm. You got sound system like City Rock. Mm-hmm. Basically, see, Rain of Rain of Wally Sound, man, yeah, Wally yeah, yeah, Sound system. But you know what I mean? I was, okay. a, you get me? I was always there, just looking in. You know what I mean? But uh-huh. well, uh, uh, there's just like a, 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 a few things, like because I'm always a fan, and, and yeah. being that young, Jamaica. What was it like? Just just a little brief reminder. As a little youth in Jamaica, the music, what was it? What was the it vibes, about? the vibes was different then. It was different then. Uh-huh. Yeah, that was that was when always, sound well, system sorry, was. Sorry to, sorry to cut you. Yeah. There's always this negative thing that we see now about Jamaica, like can't go there be a bad man thing and this yeah, and yeah, but when yeah. we see somebody like yourself who's come from jamaica and progress and just that little small amount of time right it must have been a great great them times part of your life the sound system was stringing up from six o'clock in the afternoon yeah yeah and you'd be listening to the vocals <clears throat> until the people then start rolling uh-huh. so you'd be getting a proper dance yeah. That's what we. Uh, that's what I know of dancer. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Nowadays it's different, isn't it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. A man that's coming at twelve o'clock, and that's when he starts to play. Yeah. And he be playing the tapets, and he be playing that and this and that. Okay. But and like, then yeah, and then gamble in business. Pack up him laptop and go. Mm-hmm. So boom bam. You come to England. Still got that mentality of playing music. What was your next direction once you landed? Right. One of my first intentions was getting to link with him, mm-hmm. which is Anthony, because he has to say we're blood cousin, but it took me about, what, 10 years? Wow. About why 10 was years. It, why was it so long? You know what? England's not big. <laughs> it's, uh, and I'm all in Manchester and he was all in Birmingham at the uh-huh. same time as well, what, which what, is what, down the road. Why, why, why do you think, I don't know, was that a family thing or just... No, just, just, no. it's just natural, you know. Like even, even lack of social media, maybe I don't know. It, it, I wasn't even on social media then time. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, no, but it was really. Yeah. <laughs> I think what, that was yeah, one of those yeah, things yeah. there. Yeah. So, um, well, London, England, um, you got a sound system in Manchester called Little Rock. Mm-hmm. Meet my virgin. He's from Spanish Town as well, where I'm from. Playing Little Rock for um, about say, well, 2008 up until 2019, 20. Mm-hmm. Then. 
you know sound system going you know i mean bam bam low yeah no fallout thing we still bridging and thing but you know what i mean made a move met anthony mm -hmm. well meet up back with anthony <laughs> you get me mm -hmm. yeah. boom at the same time when i met him it's like it was a right time bridging yeah because yeah. well, he's on the ball and he's like because you know what what are you doing ray 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 what song you playing because mm -hmm. it's like he knew that i was playing music i don't know how <laughs> you know what i mean because you know it's in the blood yeah so i'm linked him up and i'm like you know what because whatever you're doing i'm on it from then bam it's just one x5 and then it comes it comes it now forms x5 family straight in so let's 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 bring it let's yeah. talk let's talk because because um let's talk about x5 family let's talk about the name x5 family what does x5 stand for bmw x5 all right you know what you know you know what i'm gonna do you know you know what i'm gonna do you know what i'm gonna do because x5 x5 was name was given to us okay all right so i'm gonna let shaq i'm gonna let shaq give you that yeah and then you come and then you can come back to me right now so um in our first gear first yeah first gear first gear Right now, um, it, it was in, in Jamaica um, 2007 or 8, I can't remember, so I have a big up sharp man. Um, and I was driving, a, I had an X5 over there, and basically rolling out with the Elephant Man Bounce. What a lot of them. Mm -hmm. Anywhere we go, we just roll with them. He's got a hot Mondays on, on, what do you call it, street? Yeah. Off my lines road, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. All of them places. And then one, one time we was, must have been um, driving to halfway to him, we just pulled up and. Um, my brother Ash and Kevin British, Kevin British, the Sharkman's brother, was in the back and was mm. just talking about music and everything. He said, Yo, what are we gonna make a, a sound called X5? I said, Yo, British, say, Yeah, man, bro, bro man, yeah, <laughs> yes, man, that's so wicked. Yeah. yeah, man, drive out X5. So, and they say, Start the X5. Yeah. So when we reach back now, we link up um, Little Big now and say, Yo, we have sound there, X5. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, okay, yeah. So there was no other name, no nothing in the pipeline, like because obviously you know if you I've spoke to a couple of sound man and they said yo we was gonna call it this or we was gonna call it that. There was no pre other name that you was gonna call. Nothing in the pipeline, nothing no, in your no. head. No, no, nothing pre planned, wow. nothing planned. Just to off your head, reach back and, and say yo, Briggie X five. Say yes, that's our wicked brother. Uh -huh. <laughs> And then we had a little break, didn't we? Yeah. Me and him had a break because obviously we, we, we parted companies. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I went off on doing, we both work. We both, I work for Royal Mail. He does his um, logistics side mm -hmm. of it, everything. And uh, we had a break for about three, four years, was it? Mm -hmm. Four, probably uh, more than that. Yeah. And then um, and I linked him back up at a um, New Year's Eve party and he said, yo, come down. So and I hadn't seen him. Yeah. So I said, yeah, man, yeah, man, I'll come down there. And we held each other up and then, when you're playing music and music's in your blood and my man's DJing, I just jumped on. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just jumped on with him. Yeah. And we all had a drink and, we, and that was it. Boom. That was, that was it. And he's a shot. Let's get X5 family back wow. on the road again. And even... even, even so what, year, this, what year was that? If, if, what this, time, what this time was, was that? Because this was last year. Yeah. Wow. This was last year now. Okay. Um, and through obviously lockdown and certain things, even though... Me and Shaq and stuff wasn't wasn't linking how we are now. Mm -hmm. I still knew this X Five thing is a family. Yeah. And when it's time and the time's right, we will all link up back properly and we'll be stronger than anything coming out. Say, and, and so one second. So all the way through lockdown, I'm voicing tune, voice. Even Shaq said to me. Boy, I me can't believe say you still had voice tune and me uh -huh. name them still in them, man. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. how me know wow. say, yeah, real youth. And we did, they did, and nah, yeah, they miss. couldn't, yo, when we went through the dub, them of what had been voicing, he couldn't believe it. Mm -hmm. He couldn't believe that them thing there was still going on behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. So, that's 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 where that's where it comes. It's the so war it's tanker, like we're ready for rule out, it's man. It's literally been one of, it's, it's a story where it's just basically, so basically it's man have just literally naturally come together. Yeah, there yeah. is no real story on how mm. X5 come together. Mm. It was just when the time is right, yeah. it's time to come together. Yeah, yeah. And now you're together looking like a problem. Let's <laughs> talk about modern day <laughs> times. Because you're talking, like you're saying, like you was voicing dub plates, still calling man's name in there. Still yeah, man. being that. And I mean, I think that's a real, that's a big deal, you know, because... At that time, there obviously you're spending money. You're cutting dubs. Yeah. You, you're not really linking with this man, but you're now nah, left him out. No. Nah. 
He's still in the back At of my that mind. time there, let's talk about the dub plate cutting. Mm. Um, not too much, you know. Not too much, because I know that. Um, <laughs> you know, I know man feel me yeah. out, you know. I don't want to get it. I don't. I don't. I don't want anybody to uh, get it too twisted. But um, I've, I've listened to the X Five catalog. Mm. It's massive. <laughs> It's not a problem, okay? <laughs> and I know, I know the reason why Little Briggy keeps his thing very <laughs> under wraps. Mm. And all I can say is, it's a big deal. Mm. So we're not going to go too deep, but the listeners are going to want to know a little bit on how you go about cutting the plates. Okay. In what aspect? In terms of what are the key... Like, man just threw back a question to me you know and i'm the interviewer so it's going you know it's coming like a clash <laughs> in terms of in terms of how do you how do you go about do you um listen to other sound systems and say you are no. that one day kind of hard still you know would i get that one there or do you have your own set plan to say i want this on this rhythm and i saw the thing set like, like literally Without going too deep, it's kind of like, what's your game plan? How do you do it? All right, so... Hopefully that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So threw me off there, Bridge. So, so, so for me, win, X5 family, we're not following no sound. Mm-hmm. We do we, we do feel we want thing we own a lien. Mm-hmm. You get me? And we will try if we do things in our own way, our own style, and different. Mm-hmm. So for me... It's obviously you build, you build your juggling, you build, your, you know what rhythm yeah. tracks that you're working with. You know, you know, you know what, that's what's what. what. For me, that's what I believe in. So mm-hmm. I will run with what I believe in. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I'm not just going to go and cut any in any tune, what everyone's mm-hmm. cutting. Yeah. I want it different. Mm. Yeah. And I've got a plan in my mind when I, when I, and, I, and I always communicate with these guys on a day-to-day basis and I'm, I'm operating it like this is, a, this, is my, this is our business. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's not a joke. This ain't just a hobby. Mm. You know what I mean? This is something that we want to take this to the highest possible level. Japan, mm-hmm. China. Yeah. yeah, we're still gonna try. I'm gonna <laughs> people. If you're in tune right now, it's TV Sound System Selector Hype Live and Direct. You know, I'm gonna try my best to try and get a look a bit more out of this dub plate cutting situation. <laughs> so, in terms of, of cutting, in in from, I mean, like literally, how long have you been cutting dub plates? Um, two far, 2006 is when X5 first cut a dub plate. Can you give us a little insight on the first dub plate that you cut and which artist it was? There was a whole leap in one time, so I can't really say. <laughs> yeah, exa- it was. No, we don't cut one dub. Okay. No, one so you got a batch. It was. It was a whole leap of dubs. They were just day daily. And and, and on that time there was were, were you cutting dub plates that you specifically wanted, or was it at that early stage where you just kind of got what you wanted? Because like you said earlier on. Yeah, yeah. You know at, what I mean. At the, at the early stages, it was more. It was more. We were we were getting. The, the 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 up to date music mm-hmm. as it gradually went in we needed to have and this is the part of it is is what we what we've got we've got it in control and you can see what you're building yeah. rather than just getting tune 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 mm-hmm. <clears throat> now being a new sound because you seriously are not gonna let the cat out the bag <laughs> It's not happening. People, <laughs> I, I, even, cat, I, you know, I even... <laughs> me not like cat. <laughs> He's a lion, me out. Yeah, people, I literally, like, I tried, you know, I said to, I said to Little Brigade, I said, yo, Bridget, hear what you do. Drop me a little 20-minute X5 mix. My man messaged me back and says, hi, I don't really work like that, you know. I don't really want nobody to know nothing. So, so it's true. very so. unique. If you had to ex- describe your dub plate box then, mm. and we don't know nothing about it, because... You could be sitting in front of the camera right now, yeah. gassing, lying. Like mm. you could be just saying this just for the sake of it. Mm. Yeah. So if you had to say one word that would, you would kind of look at your dub plate box now, think about your dub plate box, yeah, yeah, and say, X Five Family dub plate box is deep. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Game plan then, because obviously, thing lockdown. You're ready to launch and do your thing. Um, how did you just reprogram yourself to say, yo? This way I go do ready for the, for, for the next the next journey. My 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 whole thing in lockdown was wait till this warm up back. Mm. 
that's only a goal out that was my that was my so i i wanted to be ready to mm -hmm. shove out and that's exactly what we've done mm -hmm. and it's been a great look mm. again like i said a lot of people have been talking about x5 family you are also took the time out to build a sound system mm. so there is an x5 sound system as well there is yeah now modern day times again mm. We have all these situations where it seems to be lack of venues, nowhere to play, mm. and there's a there's a decent amount of sounds out there. Let's not get it twisted. Yeah. That don't have no sound. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, why did you think it was still important, even though we're lacking venues, etc., cetera, etc.? Cetera, why did you mm. still think I'm going to spend a serious amount of money to still mm. buy a sound system when you could have not spent that tens of thousands? on sound system and could have just mm. shoved that 10 times more into the dub plating and then be a little bit more um be a bit more top of top on your game on the dub plating why was it important basically to have a sound system okay so as i said to you earlier on in the interview um x5 there's so many elements to x5 family we do christenings weddings mm -hmm. you know birthday parties a lot of those type of things as well mm -hmm. So it's not just it's not just a juggling club or war. Mm -hmm. We 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 want peace of everything. Yeah, and and we think to ourselves that if we're involved and we've got our hands in all of these pies, you can't lose. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're spreading your name basically. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the next thing I was going to ask you is again modern day times. Let's mm -hmm. talk about the future for X Five Family. You branded yourself very well. Mm -hmm hats off to that it's it's, it's been an a, a amazing thing to see via social media um where are your next plans right now what is your next move obviously like it says you can do everything mm. but there's always going to be a common goal we're talking about the clash thing so let's yeah. talk about obviously juggling birthday party yeah, 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 yeah. you got them to the lock yeah man yeah, you know man. what i mean coventry and surrounding areas yeah yeah they're gonna book you but the class world is a totally different kettle of fish right now. All right. It's looking kind of busy out there. Okay. And you're one of the names people are talking about. Yeah. You're not going too deep into your dub plate box, mm. but obviously you're ready. Mm. Who are you ready for? Who are you right. seeing out there that you're saying, you know what? Sound there. Uh, first, the only, the, only, the only thing I'm going to say to you, yeah, is X5 family, we no fear no son. Mm -hmm. None. And that might sound a bit bossy or whatever, mm -hmm. but we no we no freer than no sound. Mm -hmm. None of them. I don't see any sound out there right now where I would turn around and say, if a promoter call me tomorrow morning and say, boom, me want to put on that clash here, mm -hmm. if I'm up for it. Yeah. From the money's right, we're there. But as a modern day sound, is it feasible for you to say? we're gonna wait on a promoter and if the no. money's right no no isn't no, no, no. something that may be like you're so determined all right that you'd be like you know what yeah yeah we clash anybody mm. but you know what we're gonna we're gonna hit this round here so oh. better we yeah. call that okay. song there and see what they must say okay so we promoters we, are, are we, very we far right x5 now. x5 family have their own promotion mm -hmm. we don't rely upon no promoter if they do nothing so I don't, I'm not going to sit here and wait on promoters to call me. Mm -hmm. We're pushing ourselves out there. Mm -hmm. We've got our own engine behind this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we, we, we've we not invested into what we've got now for to sit around and wait for promoters. Mm -hmm. Yeah? If we want a clash and we want it with Tom, Dick or Harry, mm -hmm. it's happening. Yeah. That's where it's at. Do you have a hit list behind the scenes? Because obviously every sound is competitive. The one thing about UK... And for me, is I'm competitive as as, as competitive can be. Yeah. So if I see us, if I'm playing sound, mm. or when I was playing sound, we we're cool, mm. but I've got to be the best sound in the of UK. Course. So yeah. do you secretly behind the scenes have like a top certain set of sound? Say, yo, we have to reach that level. Oh, clearly off the experience of what you've seen happen or not happen. Yeah. To say, you know what, we want to be in that position to be able to take it that little bit further if that makes sense so we at the moment i'm saying one step at a time mm -hmm. first things first we have a bulldozer down snb and we go and we're, and we're gone from this 
So SMB is SNB is yeah. the next victim. Big up Scrapper. Yeah? Scrapper, yeah. Scrapper yeah. the first victim. Okay. Seen? And no joke thing. <laughs> Trust me. And that one is taking place very soon. We're going to drop the flyer as we're doing the interview yeah, yeah. right about now. Big up Scrapper, big up the SMB family. Yeah, man, bless um, up on yourself. Why? Yeah, why? I'm birthday yesterday. Me yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, yeah. By enough. the time this goes out, it will be after his birthday. But big up Scrapper every time, man. Um, why Why SMB? Is it because it, just because that dance is coming up first? Or like I said, that's, is it kind of like the hit list that you would like to... Nah, that's, that's imminent... Um, it's the one we're focused on right now. Mm -hmm. It's the only one that we've got coming up so yeah. far in the in the clash side of things. Mm -hmm. We've got whole heap of things going on crazy, right, yeah, differently yeah. around there. Mm -hmm. um, so it's about not taking on too much to put too much pressure on what we're doing. Okay, you know what I mean. We've got um, I can't. We've got so so many different events going on as well as dates mm -hmm. booked. So I saw you go. Okay, next question. The, the scene, UK scene right now. Mm. Um, previously or prior to X5 Family, you've seen the UK cop clashes, you've seen the UK rumbles. Yeah. I'm sure you've been in the place or mm. you've heard the audio, etc., etc. Um, What makes you think that you can be on the same level as those sound systems? I don't see any of them doing anything different, different or being more competitive than we can be. Mm -hmm. So... We can, we can, we can compete. The there's nothing, there's not, there's not even one sound out there right now in UK that I would say is doing something that is far from anybody else's level. Mm. A lot of things are doing the same. A lot of, a lot of people are doing the same. So I'm looking forward to, to what, what we can bring to this because it's the new generation. Mm. And I think the, the market is there for the new generation. Mm -hmm. I'm not, I wouldn't sit here and disrespect no sound and I'm not pointing no fingers. No. I'm just saying in, in, in the overall picture. Yeah. Super competitive. Yeah. Okay. So let's um, kind of wrap it up because it's just, you've got so much events that are taking place right now. Yeah. Um, summer is around the corner. How far ahead are you planning right now in terms of X5 family? Is there anything else? Obviously, we're going to try and put up as many like events that you're doing right now. We're always pushing out your thing. Yeah, but yeah. In, let's, let's talk two years from now, three yeah. years from now. Where, you, where would you expect X5 family to be? Japan. Japan. Why Japan? Because this is going to be super interesting because <laughs> Japan <laughs> is a place <laughs> where I swear down, <laughs> man, I have a yo. Why Japan? Why? Why? Okay. <laughs> They love reggae music. They love reggae music, and there's just something about I have to touch down there with X Five. Mm -hmm. I have and to. not Europe, not the, like the Germany well, and the the, the uh, yeah. Holland and yeah. France and don't Italy get don't get don't don't get me Belgium, wrong. Mexico. Don't get me wrong. If the if if the date come mm -hmm. and it works, yeah, of course we will. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Of course we will. But our overall agenda is Japan. That's where we want to enter. It's massive. And we've got the link. We, we've, we've got, we've, you know, we've the seen, link. We've, the we've, links we've, we've seen Sound Systems go over there. Big shout out to Natural Natural Affair. They did their thing over there in yeah. Japan as well. Um, obviously, it's, it's, it's the birthplace of the likes of Mighty Crown. Yeah, man. And yeah. if you understand Japan mm. on a level, mm. you, I, I understand why I fully agree with exactly why yeah, the yeah, first yeah. place you're going to mm. touch down. Yeah. Is, is Japan. If you have your whole marketing thing and your whole strategy right, mm. I think it can go on, man. Trust yeah, man. Me. Of course. Um, let's. Yeah. And I think, you know what? In the, in the sound system world right now, I don't think there's anywhere that appreciates it more than Japan. Mm. Yeah, uh, they love it. Mm -hmm. they love it. <laughs> Jamaica, Jamaica is where it's born, but when you. Japan, it's a different level. It's a different, it's a different world. All oh, right. Japan is, is like a different right. world. Do you think you have that catalog of songs that will connect with oh, the what? Japanese? You remember the, the, the before you said two to three years. It, no worry, man. He might try and let the cat out of the bag again. He might try, he might try. But seriously, like, yeah, do you, do you think like th that is the kind of thing that Japan people will gravitate to. Of course. Obviously, uh, uh, being a sound system and being a young sound system and a new sound system, having such a high um, 
aspiration mm. to go to places like that. You're obviously going to have that catalogue super, super deep, as you said. Yeah, man. Well, what can I say? X5 family are up inside the building. TV sound system. Selector hype is live and direct. These guys are throwing me too many curveballs. <laughs> They're not going to go around the ting. <laughs> They're not going to go around the ting. There's some big events that are going to be taking place. Yeah, yeah. you got a big dance taking place coming soon with Jabooks. That's next week, Saturday. That's like going to be next week, Saturday. So by the time this goes out, which I'm going to make sure it goes out Monday. Wicked. Hopefully Respect. by then, and I'll, hopefully I can come down to the event to come and yeah, check yeah, out yeah. you guys. Um, um, I'm gonna go back a little bit as a new sound. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go back onto the dub plate. Wow. Yeah, man. <laughs> do your thing, man. Do your thing. I mean, I There's been there. so much conversation and controversy about the cost of dub plates. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that something you're worried about? Is that something that you j- how, how just just your analysis analysis on the prices of dub plates in modern day times right now with with it for me it's always been about who you know mm-hmm. it's it's and, and 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 for me i'm happy with my connect i couldn't be more blessed mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. trust me what kind of what kind of songs is, is your connect cutting kind of any song we want this is the reason why i have them in the top 10 sound systems for the uk it's such a vibes right here i love the way how the, you have the energy you have the confidence you have the vision you have the marketing you have everything going your way right now i don't think you are missing in any kind of situation so um, let's pause X Five's family just for a little bit. Yeah. Let's talk about some of the other UK sounds. I and mean, who are the UK sounds? And even though you says, you know, I don't fear no UK sounds, or you, you're ready for anything, which you're supposed to mm. as a competitive sound system. Yeah, yeah. You cannot be here saying, boy, I'm frightened at him. I'm frightened. No, but in terms of ratings and respect, um, between the three of you, pass the mic around. Yeah, yeah. Who are the sound systems and who you? Inspired to who you looked up to and who you're rating right now. Okay, so Immortal Tyrone, me and him grow together. Mm-hmm. My brethren, what he's done for himself from where he's come from and from where he's come from through love injection, etc. Massive mm-hmm. ratings, ratings. Um, I've not listen to them myself live but platinum cartel mm-hmm. ratings mm. yeah 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 same thing um willpower grown up from the veteran mm-hmm. veteran still going strong oh, nah. ratings mm-hmm. you want yeah, man, yeah pass the mic around Let's, and like like same same yeah. same thing your uk wise you don't know me respect every song mm-hmm. standard because we're all doing the same game you understand what i mean but up now you know classic my sound same way you have a next sound down in a birmingham is it love injection mm-hmm. yeah. me always have a passion for the sound there and i love for the sound they understand differently from that you know you have a couple more sound of the same way you understand but mm-hmm. we still love and respect same way yeah. Super shock, what you say? Who sound is it? Super shock, you're bringing this thing, you know. <laughs> right, I'm going to go back now for, from where, when I used to live in London, and you're talking about Volcano, Unity, Saxon, back in the day, and then the sounds, as a UK young young man, and looking up to them back in the day, uh, uh, and then looking in the yard, like Bass Odyssey and Stone, but today, nowadays now, there's, I just want to respect all sounds, because the, the, the game's a hard game. <laughs> And um, the problem with the game right now is, is, is the promotion side of it, as you said, Mark, yeah? And there's a big a lot of controversy with the, the dub plates and promoters and promoters obviously want to make their money back by booking s- certain sounds. Mm. So it's a hard game to get into. So, so I just want to big up all, all of the sound in, in UK right now. Cause yeah. it's, it's a hard, hard, hard game. Yeah. But you have to, <laughs> it's a hard back and field. Yeah. <laughs> and, the, and, the, and the field are done yet. Yeah, big classic. Yeah, man, big up classic. Yeah, mm-hmm. stereophonic from we back in the idea. Yeah, Kiba Negus, Jama Nuclear back mm-hmm. in the day. Injection representing UK right now. Big up themselves, you're right. Um, and all you sound, man. I mean, I got this no sound, but yo, big up yourself. And it's it's a it's a it's a fight, and we're gonna continue keep yeah. um, dance all our life. Yeah. Yeah, man, hundred percent, man. Again, um, before we wrap up everything, 
X5 Family is kind of like a new sound. Although you all got history and you've been doing your yeah, yeah. thing, you're the new sound mm. who I believe two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine years are going to keep this sound system culture alive, keep reggae music alive. It's going to be a great thing. Mm. There are now younger sounds looking at you. Yeah. Mm. Like you are the new generation, but there's going to be a generation yeah, of course. before that. Yeah. A couple of other sounds that, who are out there right now mm. um, that we can name that I've put literally in my own top 10. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, who yeah. are out there right now who are competing on the same level as you. Um, advice for a young sound right now wanting to come into the business. Obviously, it's a very expensive game, et cetera, et cetera. But in terms of rather than shutting them down, mm. look a bit of advice to say, you know what, you Yeah. I just so. organi organization and togetherness that's a massive thing with sound system if you notice in sound system it's very rare you see the same set of man them around the sound for a good long time mm. and, and togetherness loyalty loyalty into what you're doing. your plan and, and execute your plan mm -hmm. and be it. unique Don't be out of the place. you know mm -hmm. you that's the yeah it's a business yeah, that's it. yeah, you have to treat it as a business. Can sound system be a business? Yeah, of course it can. It is a business. I mean, and I, I asked that question because the amount of money that gets put in, a lot of them own a lot of sound systems don't get that back. And, and a lot of people them say sound system is just an expensive hobby. In modern day times right now, would you agree with that and say, you know what, it's just an expensive <laughs> hobby? Yeah, it, it, do you know what? I believe... I, that's... <laughs> For the investment that you put into it, that is the way people will see it. Hmm. But if your plan is bigger than your investment, then of course you're going to get back your money. Do you hear what the man says? Time. The man says, <laughs> if your plan is bigger than your investment, then there you go. I think we're going to have to wrap this one up neatly. <laughs> X5 family <laughs> are live and direct. Come out to Coventry. We're inside the Heritage family. Big shout out, reach out to the Heritage family because we're here live and direct. And again, we've got so many questions, but the questions that I have, they man, they're just throwing the curveballs, man, because <laughs> it's the duck play situation. A lot of people them are very excited to hear the X5 dub plate catalogue. I'm sure the big dance with S and B. 5th of March. 5th of March. It's going to be fully loaded. You're yeah, going to unleash. Yeah, man. I'm going to be down there inside the building. We're not a wall back no shot that night there. It's going to be an absolute movie. <laughs> and then from there, we're going to see X5 Family. You've got so many other events taking place. you got the Jerk. Is it Jerk Thursday? Jerk and Jam. Jerk and Jam, that's taking place. That's my birthday bash, that is. Okay. So we're so celebrating. We, so all day mm -hmm. and night, Shawnee B. Okay. Shawnee B, right through um, Jerk and Jam. So we're doing it the brunch style. Mm hmm all day just bank holiday sunday the 17th of april don't miss that do not miss that okay. immortal sound system is going to be there right through the day mm. sit down meal throughout the day and then shawnee b and what we just we just go and party crazy in the night you get me how how's the vibes in coventry right now and how proud are you to be putting coventry back on the map and how do coventry people um are interacting with what you're doing right now they're lo loving it we, we've we've got the support network um, it will grow and grow and grow, but to where we are right now, I'm excited. Mm -hmm. I'm very excited in every single category of what we want to do moving forward. We've got um, a big people dance part two, which is what people <laughs> have demanded from us. Mm -hmm. You remember the songs used to make you rock away part two? Yeah. That was very successful. This is all our own promotion. Um, and that's again at Coventry Caribbean Centre on the 26th of February. Um, yeah, that's a that's a big event. Well, I think that is it. Put it's your woman on your arm and forward, you know? <laughs> People, it's been a movie. Like I said, this is not the interview. It's a sit-down conversation. Mm. And that's exactly like how I wanted it to be. The man them come all the way from Coventry and Manchester to come and sit down here inside the Heritage in Wolverhampton for TV Sound System. We're going to wrap it up. Is there anything else that you want to tell us? Like a little bit more about your plate collection? No, man. <laughs> <laughs> and apart from, like me say, 5th of March, come listen to some of them. Month. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> X5 <laughs> family were in my top 10 for the UK sounds for 20 years. If you can swim, you can look in there. Quite no? <laughs> <Okay>, deep. <laughs> 
<laughs> X5 family for 2022 were in my top 10 for the UK sounds to watch out for. Clearly, you can see they have a vision, they have a passion, they're a family unit, the marketing, promotion, everything seems to be on par right now. All we can do is sit back, relax, watch the movie, and also, main thing is support everything what they're doing right now. Thank you yeah, guys yeah, so man. much for taking the time out yeah, right now. Is there anybody man. that you want to big up? And can you please give everybody your social media platforms so everybody knows where they can connect with the X5 family? Shout it out, man. Shout it out. Yes, people, no. you can find us at um, Facebook at X5 family. You don't know Instagram, X5 family, same way. You can find, well, Royal Sound. Don't forget the Royal, the, the Royal Pony, because it's a Royal Sound. Mm -hmm. You can find Super Shock individually on his page, which is Super Shock at Facebook, Instagram, see me. ZJ Demos, Facebook, see me. So it, 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 we're there, we're all over the place. Yeah. You understand, people? So big up on yourself. TV sound system, make sure to like, subscribe the video. Big up the world UK, big up the world world, you don't know. And one thing I want to do while, before we go, Big up Mark, thank you for the invite. Yeah, much love, it was man. a pleasure, it was a much pleasure love. to come, you know. And, and we're gonna continue this because yeah, man. because um we're just this is just scratching the surface. Yeah, yeah. Like I says, it's kinda of like just having a, a, a link up with the X5 family individually. We could all have a conversation on the history. Yeah, Big man, man from Wolverhampton, come on man. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? We can talk about the history yeah, of okay. where everybody yeah, yeah. came from. I mean, your dad playing Black Crusader is a big deal. Mm. It's a big whole different conversation. Yeah, yeah. So just to have you guys here and showing what the X5 family is about, I, I, I really respect the time that you've took out for that. So no problem. all it is, is this is not going to be the first. There's going to be many on, interviews. Of course. Many That's interviews. Fine. I want to big up the whole support network. You know who you are in Jamaica. We're not give it up neither. Yeah. <laughs> Seeing? Brain yeah, man. Maximum red. respect. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Bless up yourself, Mark. Yeah, man. Bless up yourself, Mark. And it's been a pleasure coming here. I uh, want to big bless up all the sound system right now in the UK. And um, it's going to be an exciting year. Next two years is going to be very exciting. So just look out for us because it's going to be all about killing. All right? God bless. Um, yeah, man. Big respect, reaching out to my brother, Selector Hype, you know, and the Sound System TV on YouTube. Remember to click that subscribe button for all your updates in regards to the Sound System culture, you know. Yeah, man. Bang, I say so.